screw. A screw is a modified version of an inclined plane. It is actually an inclined plane in a circular form. It is a sharp pointed metal pin with a thread wound round it. It has a slotted head. It is used to join or hold things together by being rotated under pressure. Water is sometimes lifted from a river to irrigate a field with a device called an Archimedes screw. Each time the screw turns, it lifts water a little bit higher up inside a tube. It was very popular in Egypt. The common screw and nut bolt used for fixing parts of engines and machinery together works in the same way. Wedge All sharp things have a special shape which makes our work of either cutting an object or piercing a material easier. The wedge is a special kind of inclined plane. Place two inclined planes back to back and we get a wedge. Axe, knife, saw, needle and sickle are examples of wedge. Lever There are three kinds of levers. These are with different arrangements of load, effort and fulcrum. Let us study the simplest kind of lever to understand the concept of load, effort and fulcrum. The man is using an iron rod to lift the heavy package. He has placed a block of wood close to the package and he is resting the rod on it. He applies a downward force and thus is able to lift the package. Here the iron rod is the lever. The package to be lifted is the load. The wooden block is the fulcrum or pivot. The fulcrum is the fixed point of the lever as the load will move and so will the effort. The force which the man is using to lift the package is known as the effort. The effort put at one end of the rod is transferred to the other end of the rod which was pushed under the load and the work gets done. Here the fulcrum is between the load and the effort. In these the fulcrum is at one end, the effort is applied at the other end and the load is in between. In the third kind of lever, the effort is in between and the load and the fulcrum are at the two ends. Wheel and Axle The wheel on its axle is another example of a simple machine. An axle is the rod to which a wheel is connected. When you turn the handle of an egg whisking slowly, it moves the wheel at a greater speed. The axle transmits this turning motion to the blades, which rotate fast to do their job. Motorcycles Cars, trains are some machines that move on wheels. So now we know simple machines are devices used to make work easier and quicker.